In the arms of Armenia's nature, I have time to reflect, to nourish my brain, and to find my escape. These clouds of green, so many trees, that you can feel it in the air that you breathe. All of it sustained by our water, clear and fresh. Sevan is one of the largest freshwater lakes in Eurasia, at 1,900 meters above sea level. Here, you can observe a rare sight. Civilizations of free white lorises bravely soaring across the sky over a little island in Sevan. The Devil's Bridge conceals a hidden paradise with pools of warm, healing mineral waters and stalactite caves. There's so much peace here. You can lose yourself, watching the water flowing and breaking onto the rocks in a flurry of white at Terichgan Waterfall. I half expect hobbits to live here, with fields of beautifully colored flowers. You may encounter some of the most interesting creatures deep within the forest of Khosrov, the rarest and most majestic of them all being the Caucasian leopard. They roam about the ancient fortress left behind, and they are the masters of this dominion. Surrounding a lake at the top of a mountain, 3,300 meters above sea level, there are a collection of stones with ancient petroglyphs carved into them, proof these mountains have seen civilizations come and go. If you go to Lori, you'll see our canyons and discover your adventurous side and face nature head on. In the south, you'll find cliffs and canyons of rustic orange and red, as though someone took a paintbrush and splashed the landscape with warm colors of the sun. Here, in the shadowy cliffs, you'll meet bezoar goats, nature's fearless alpinists teaching us about the importance of confidence. Armenia's nature has so much to offer, but more than anything, Armenia is the land of the sun. A sun that shines brightly in Armenia for 300 days of the year.